In this video, you will learn how to create multi-category bar or column chart in Microsoft Excel. You can see here I have generated this multi-category bar chart using this set of data. It is the data about the comparison of rainfall during different years. First column shows the years which are the categories. Second one shows the months which are the subcategories. And third column shows the rainfall. So let's uh, learn how to create this multi-category bar chart in Microsoft Excel. In a separate sheet, I have already entered the data to save time. Firstly, I will select this data. After the selection of this data, go to Insert tab. And here you will find the option of Insert column or bar chart. Click here and you will find different options. I will select bar chart. So I will use this option. After that, I will resize it using these handles. Go to this add chart element option. Click on it and here I will remove the grid lines. I will uncheck this option. And here there is the option of axis title. I want to insert only X axis title. So I will Go to this arrow sign, click here, and here you will find the option of primary horizontal. I will check this option. Now select chart title, put equal sign in formula bar, and select the cell which contain title, or you can also manually write it. Press enter. Now go to home tab and format it according to your requirement. Firstly select this title and from here you can format it. I will select black color. I will bold it and from here you can adjust the size. I will select 20. Secondly select this X axis option and format it according to your requirement. I will choose black color for it and bold with 12 size. Now I will copy this format and apply it on this, uh, this axis. So for after selecting this, I will use format painter option and click here. Similarly, I will also want to apply similar type of format on this axis title. So I will copy this format using format painter option and click here to apply it. Now I want to edit this axis title simply I will put file equal sign in formula bar and select rainfall press enter now I will again select it right click go to format axis option and from here I will go to fill and line option and there is the option of solid line I will choose this option scroll down and from here you can choose the color black color is already selected so I will not change it and I will change the width to 1.5 pt using this option similarly I will select other axis and I will choose solid line with black color and 1.5 pt width now go to this axis option and from here you can select minimum value and maximum value. You can see here minimum value is 0, maximum value is 150. And you can also adjust the unit. Currently these units are uh, at the gap of 50. So I will reduce it to 30. Now I will scroll down and there is the option of tick marks. Click on it and I want tick marks both major type and minor type so I will select tick marks on outside you can see here tick marks are inserted here now 
you can see here these there is no space between these categories i want to create a space between these categories so i will select this one this line which contain the year right click and go to insert option and i want to insert entire row click on ok now you can see here the entire row is created here again select this one right click and go to insert option and choose entire row click on ok now select these bars click on any bar you can see here all bars are selected right click go to format data series option and here you will find the option of gap width you can adjust the gap width there are three options available you can use any one from these for example firstly you can adjust it using this option you can drag it in any direction and it this value will be changed or you can use up and down arrow i will manually write it 50 percent which is the easiest method i will adjust the gap its value to 50 percent you can see here the gap width is changed now now the last option is to how to change the color of these bars because you can see here i have multi categories and i want to adjust the color of each categories with different color or i want to display the different colors bars in each categories firstly i want to insert a border around these bars so i will again select these bars and go to fill and line option and there is the option of border you can see here in border i will choose solid line and color of the border will be black and the width 1 pt now i want to change the color of these bars so firstly i will select this one you can see here all bars are selected i will click on it again now you can see here only one bar is selected right click go to format data point and again go to fill and line option from here i will choose solid fill and you can select any color for example i will choose green color click on other bars and again choose green color similarly select third one and i will choose green color fourth one i will choose green color you should remember one thing that if you uh, one time click on these bars then all bar will be selected if you double click after selecting all bars again click on any bars then that particular bar will be selected similarly i want to change these to these categories to purple one so i will choose purple color i will select other bars and select change its color to purple third one and purple color similarly fourth one and change it color to purple last one and from here i will choose purple color by doing so we, you can see here we have completed the formatting of this graph thanks for watching this video hopefully this video will be helpful for you goodbye